we in here what is up youtube it is your boy post post gaming and today we are talking about software versus software when it comes to call of duty everybody know its biggest competitor is battlefield and that being said when it comes to sales call of duty being the titan as it is always wins hands down now although this year call of duty infinite warfare is the worst call of duty to ever ever ever, ever hit the internet with almost what 200,000 dislikes of its video reveal on youtube a couple of months ago uh people do not like this game at all mostly the battlefield people because you know the fanboy wars stretch on just beyond xbox versus playstation you know it also goes into game genres like shooters versus shooters especially when it comes to call of duty and battlefield so even i have to admit that call of duty over its years has been getting worse and worse and worse and worse especially when it comes to these jet packs these upgrade guns these kill streaks the, the, the attachments the, the shit that you can do with call of duty oh my god if they completely destroyed this game but as a call of duty fan that i am i still purchase infinite warfare why because I am a competitor and that's the type of game I can get from Call of Duty playing Call of Duty most people will say wait a minute pose what Call of Duty is not a competitive shooter you are wrong if you are into esports Call of Duty is the number one console well not console game that is on console that is running esports. It's number one on PlayStation. Esports. That's all you see. Call of Duty tournaments. One million dollar tournaments here. One million dollar tournaments there. And all Call of Duty. Do you see it in any other game? Not that big. Uh, there are other games though, like Rainbow Six, which I'm also into, but it's not as huge as Call of Duty is. And I am experienced in Call of Duty. But this year, Battlefield 1, I have to give this credit because I would rather play Battlefield 1 when it comes to public matches. I would rather play that than sit here and play Call of Duty. The only reason why I play Call of Duty is because I'm a competitor. And when I mean competitor, I play private matches against people for money. You know, that sort of type of thing. That is why I play Call of Duty. I don't play Call of Duty to prestige over and over again to get these new guns, these new camos, all this other stuff, all this fancy shit. All, the, all that shit, y'all, that's, that, that is the worst of Call of Duty. I don't want that. When it comes to playing Call of Duty, I'm strictly on the MLG wagon, the esports wagon. That's where I come from, and that's how I play competitive. That's where I see the competition at when it comes to Call of Duty. Everything else is casual based. Just like Battlefield 1 is casual based. I cannot enter a tournament on um, Battlefield. I mean, maybe, yeah, online, but I can't find people to play that because it's just too casual. Battlefield is too casual. It's not a competitive shooter for me. That's my opinion. So, let me know what y'all feel. Even Call of Duty at its 50% sales rate outsells Battlefield this year. And Battlefield is embarrassed to even give their sales out. The, what they're telling is just well, how many people have been playing, how many hours, and this and that. What are you, your guys' thoughts? Leave it in the comment section. This is your boy Pose, Pose Gaming, and uh, peace. I'm out.